This is not where you will come or you need to come. Amend your ways before the Lord so that you will not come there. Beloved, as we live our life daily, as we live our life daily, let us have the fear of the Lord, not in the back of our heart, in the front. You know, they will use the word, just put in the back of your mind. Mm -mm, mm -mm, not back. And the things you have behind, you can forget them. Anything behind, there's a tendency for you to forget. The fact that the word of the Lord has been put the word of God in the back of your mind, that's why you've been sinning. You've been committing sin because you always forget that the word of God is there. Put it in front of your heart. The things going on in the world now will tell you that the, war, the, the, the end is near. If you want to know concerning the Russian war and Ukraine and other things happening, go to Matthew chapter 24. You will read it there. You will see it there. The scripture has said what is happening today is that we are a step to his coming. Let's stand to our feet as we pray. Say, Father, please don't ever let me be a candidate of hellfire. In the mighty name of Jesus, go ahead and talk to the Lord. Lord, help me not to be a candidate. Please, I need your help. I need your help. You can still come to church from morning to night on every day and you still go to hell. What's not the purpose of coming to the church? Lord, I need your help. Father, I need your help. Help me. Help me. Help me, Lord. Five seconds. Help me every day. Help me every day. Help me every day. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your name forevermore. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. <laughs> Quickly, you pray for Daddy and Mommy and the family. Daddy and Mommy and Mephene. Lord, guide them wherever they are. And help them. And bring your word to pass in their life. Lord, guide them, help them. Their children, preserve them. Let them continue to fear you. You know their heart desire. You know their prayer requests. Father, please answer them to your glory. Lord, answer them. Answer them. Let's also pray for Daddy and Mommy Gio. Two days from now, our daddy will be 80. The Lord will strengthen him more and more. The Lord will empower him. He shall be well with Daddy and Mommy Gio. Daddy Enoch Adejare Adeboye and Mommy Fulu Adeboye. And their children and the work of God in their hands is our Father. Let's pray for him. Thank you, Father. For in Jesus mighty name we pray as we pray this morning so shall it be as we go this day from the house of god may the presence of the lord go with us in the mighty name of jesus may we not be short of god's presence this day may the name of the lord be glorified in our lives we will have testimonies to share on daily basis so shall it be so it is in jesus mighty name we we'll pray. The grace, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit rest and abide with us now and forevermore. Amen. Let your surely be sure. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Then look at someone beside you. Look at the fellow. I want you to be a prophet and a prophetess to that fellow. Look at the fellow. Say, Shalom. Shalom. Nothing missing. Shalom. Nothing broken. Shalom. Until I see you again. Shalom.